It's February, which is Black History Month, and to celebrate, the ABC network suspended Whoopi Goldberg for two weeks over statements she made about the Holocaust. My words upset so many people, which was never my intention. This is the Iron Troll Show. I'm Zelio High. And I'm Beatrice Yach, and I was also once suspended for two weeks. That was in high school after the principal caught me in the boys' bathroom with Johnny Wilson. Beatrice, were you smoking in the boys' room? I most certainly was not, but there was a lot of heat, if you know what I mean. So, Whoopi Goldberg was suspended by ABC. Punished like a little schoolgirl for saying the Holocaust wasn't about race, but about whites fighting against whites, which is a common misperception. Whoopi apologized for her ignorance and used her mistake as an opportunity to educate herself and others about the Holocaust. I regret my comments as I said and I stand corrected. I also stand with the Jewish people as they know and y'all know. Of course, the Holocaust was about race. The Nazis decided that they were the master race and everyone else was inferior. So they came up with their ultimate solution to cleanse the world and start exterminating people, mainly Jews. Six million men, women, and children were murdered by the Nazis. This has been investigated and documented many times over the 75 years since World War II, and I know that there are people who still nitpick about that number because of something they read on the internet. But they're just trying to to minimize or deny the racist genocide committed by white supremacists. Which interestingly enough sounds like what conservatives are trying to do by abolishing critical race theory and black history education in schools. White supremacists always have reasons to justify their actions and those reasons are 0% reality and 100% bullshit. Whether it was 6 million or 600, the bottom line is that people were considered inferior because of their race and then exterminated by the Nazis while much of the world turned a blind eye. Ignorant statements are often offensive, but if the powers that be at ABC were a little less focused on the internal problems of their network and a little more aware of what's going on in the country, they could have used Whoopi's ignorance about the Holocaust as an opportunity to educate. There are so many people in America who know very little about the Holocaust. The View could be having discussions on systemic racism and the oppression of Jews, blacks, and other minorities in instead of trying to shame an icon because she said something wrong. They could be talking about the growing white supremacy movement in America and around the world, the rise in hate crimes, and all the states around the country passing laws to oppress minorities and women. The View could be using history to educate their audience to try and stop history from repeating itself. Because it is. It most certainly is. Well, that's our show for today. Thanks for listening to our rant. Please show us some love by liking, following, or subscribing. Bye, everybody. Bye, y'all. I misspoke.